Hi, sometimes I'm John Landis and you're watching Trailers from Hell. Today we're going to look at a gorilla picture, which immediately makes it a good movie. There are certain things, gorilla, good movie. Anyway, this is The Bride and the Beast, written by Edward Wood. Her beauty hides a hideous past that makes her a strange attraction for a jungle brute. This is the Lynn Cheney story. Oh, look! Angora sweaters. She's wearing an Angora sweater, which is a hint to who wrote this, Ed Wood. I have a feeling that it probably said in the script that she wore an Angora sweater. And, you know, these are low-budget quickies. That's a gorilla. Um, I, I think that's Crash Corrigan. You know what? I'm embarrassed. I don't know which gorilla that is. But this is a wacky story. Watch. The money shot. Ooh. There it is. That's it. And they showed it to you in the trailer. She has nightmares, this lady, about being a white gorilla who looks strangely like White Pongo, which is another movie with the same suit. Um, anyway, she wakes up in her Angara sweater. This movie is mostly footage from some other black and white picture, some jungle adventure that they keep cutting back and forth to. There's a whole subplot with this tiger. Um, look at this. This Watch. Stuffed stuffed real <laughs> and these are very real crocodiles very real tiger this was stuff shot by some white man who decided to uh you know destroy nature very weird tiger versus crocodile here she puts up a big fight and he carries her off her husband's kind of a putz he's a great white hunter but very few people know that the bronson caves are in africa and look, two gorilla suits, two gorilla suits, the raging violence of a maddened ape in a frenzied battle with a woman as a prize. How can you not go see this movie? Now, this is a good trailer. In fact, don't see the movie. The trailer's better. The Bride and the Beast.